what is going on guys and welcome to html tutorial in brackets in this video we're going to explore the table headings and how they make our tables look better so you can see that i have the same setup over here i still created a table element and now i would have to create a table rows and table data right so the first thing that i'm going to do i would insert table row and within that table row the difference would be that i would create a table headings so i would write th instead of td so let's do this so i'm going to write th over here and then i'm going to copy it two times and over here i'm going to write a, the same thing i'm going to write susie and i'm going to write bobby over here bobby so there's two there's two table headings right uh, so let's create another row over here, right underneath. And I'm just going to copy this. Copy and paste. So now you can see that I have created another row. However, the point of the table headings is, is that actually they so serve only as a whole heading, not that if you're tr like putting them all over your table. So I would have to change this one around, and I'm going to write over here table data. So it's going to be TD, and it's the same going to be over here, and same going to be over here. However, you can see over here that uh, table heading over here that I still left. And here I'm going to write grade. And let's say it's going to be grade for both of them. So I'm just going to say that Susie has A, and Bobby has B. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to create another row. So I'm just going to copy this paste in lower and i'm going to do the same thing i'm going to here i'm going to write gpa gpa and i don't know here i'm going to write 3.8 and here i'm going to write i don't know 3.2 something like that All right sorry 3.3 .3. so you can see that i can create table headings both ways i can create across the row and across the column but keep in mind that you can see over here, this corner over here, this table heading, it needs to be there. It's not just by because it's a mistake. So let's say that I would delete this, right? Let's say that you think that it's better if it's not there. And you can see right away how your whole table is actually shifting. So you need to have that table heading or table data or whatever you want. However, the actual tags need to be there. So it keeps the actual space there. Otherwise, your table is going to start shifting left and right where you wouldn't want it to shift. This is going to be it for the video, guys. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.